He's gonna push. Rip. Jesus! People are falling from the skies! Well, I've got a couple of nice builds now for you, Marauders. You see, if you've been following German Engineering these past few weeks and now, guys, let's go ahead and make a build for the Mauler 2P, the other free mech that was available for MechWarrior Online during Xmas. This bad boy is going to run with a double Daka and some lasers. Hi, friends. I'm, of course, still TTB. Welcome back to German Engineering, the show we share our love for big stompy robots and creative builds today with a nice ultra auto cannon combo that makes use of the quirks of this beautiful mech. Now the quirks that make this mech so nice are ultra auto cannon jam chance minus 20%. That's a very significant redu reduction in there. And we've got inner sphere ultra auto cannon heat generation minus 25%. So you're generating only 75% of the heat that you would normally generate with these weapons. 5% missile spread, 10% missile velocity, 10% cooldown flat on everything, and 10% laser heat generation, plus a little bit of extra structure on CT and torsos, and 30% less critical hit chance received. So really, really nice for ultra auto cannon and laser combination builds, I would say. Let's have a look under the hood, shall we? Here we are in the loadout screen. As you can see, we're running a standard engine 300. I have opted to go with an Ultra AC-20 in the right torso, an Ultra AC-10 in the left torso, and six medium lasers in total, three in each arm. As far as the ammo is concerned, I am packing four tons of Ultra AC-20 ammo and three tons of Ultra AC-10 ammo, and we're using case here to tie and protect uh, the rest of our mech in case one of the side torsos gets blown off before the ammo has a chance to be used. Um, if you're looking at the side torso armor right here for the UAC-20, um, that's about seven or eight shots so four or five double taps and this one ton of uac 20 ammo is going to be gone so it's not something that you would be that curious or that concerned about but there's always a chance that that somebody hits you on the back or something the ammo cooks off and boom your side toes is gone and if you don't have case then then the damage just travels into your ct as well so that way you can at least get to save half your mech although at that point you're basically reduced to a uh, enforcer if you look at the weapon systems, then with one laser and one ultra auto cannon. In any case, we also stop uh, and add another double heatsink here in the left torso to fill out our mech. Endosteel structure, double heatsinks. Uh, we have two double heatsinks in the engine as well. And we have to shave the legs a little bit. But other than that, we can leave max armor on all the other components. Definitely leave max armor on the arms, guys, with a mauler. If you look at the mauler... The arms are fairly big, and they take quite a bit of damage, especially if you're moving around or are aiming at targets with your arms. Sometimes uh, you might aim a little bit higher or whatnot. Um, these huge protruding things get hit a lot, so do not discount the value of armor on arms on the Mauler. They are really, really nice shield arms. I mean, the Mauler itself is too big for its uh, tonnage. It's just a huge chunk of metal, um, but the arms can tank a little bit if you twist in a wise manner. And of course, make sure to unlock your arms if you have to, because then you can shoot at UEs or targets that are high above you. Uh, 127 CT armor, quite nice. Side torso, I got it up to 82. Um, I think the Mauler is still under-protected, under-armored for the amount of tonnage that it brings. If you compare a Mauler with a Highlander, um, there's, it's, it's a no contest. Um, so I think they should revisit Mauler quirks and uh, give it a little bit more tankiness, because for a mech that's that easy to hit, uh, it doesn't really have that much tankiness. Now, moving on to the skill tree. As always, just pause the video when you want to have a look in more detail. Here is the firepower tree, laser duration, and of course, enhanced rack UAC plus uh, ammo. Then we have the survival tree, as tanky as possible. Then we use the census tree to get seismic and some rated deprivation, and double cool shot with cool shot cooldown, and that is going to be our build for today, guys, a Buccaneer paint job, by the way, with a little bit of mint and a berry going on there in case you were wondering. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, share it with your friends. Get more people to try out MechWarrior online. And of course, hit the thumbs up button to help with the algorithm on YouTube. And if you want to support me in doing this full time, then check out the various links in the video description below. Thank you so much to everybody who is chiming in. Uh, couldn't do it without you. Enjoy the clips. I couldn't understand anything. The guy had his TV running in the background or something, but I think he meant Grrrr! Or not. It's a fast boy Atlas, actually. He's going fails. He's going places. He has to go somewhere. This this Atlas needs to take a dump. Target spotted. 
He's rushing for the toilet. There will be nothing in his way between him and the shitter. Because he needs to take an atlas-sized dump. Target Imagine all that on. old m machine oil and how it's gonna smell. Oof. It's gonna be a wet dump. Ooh. <laughs> okay, I'll stop the analogy here. Let's just stop it right there. <laughs> the hunchback you see is not gonna be long for this world. He's gonna be running and he's gonna be running straight into the arms of the Atlas. Um, okay. Artillery strike. Snipers up top, Echo 4. Yes, yes, come to us, little man. That was a bad shot on my part. I can't aim. I can't aim. I'm trash. I am trash. Rack fives, huh? How much for that? Fanatos on our right, Echo 5, Echo 4. I think they took a component out. Target spotted. Trying to shield that Atlas a little bit. Then shoot the UV here. They're coming right behind Sky, they're swarming over an Echo 5. Target acquired. This guy's still alive? Dude. They're shielding the enemies with their asses! New target spotted. Target spotted. Let's get right back into it. Are we doing full trench warfare here? Oh! Is that the Urbi trash can that I just shot? Wait, can you shoot somebody else, please? Why always TTB? There are other targets than TTB you can shoot. Damn it! I would I would love to be able to put down my artillery strike now. That wasn't bad. Come on! There we go! Artillery strike is out! New target acquired. Ah, the Atlas. Alright. Potentially problematic. Are they hitting them nicely? Alright. Now we can go. Can't see shit, unfortunately, but that's okay. Acquired. Just gotta be careful with teammates walking in front of me. They seem to like doing that, this match. Uh, let's go for this way. He's gonna push. Rip. Jesus! People are falling from the skies! Let's go in there. Say hello. Rip. Two guys left, they're both up top, I think. It's our friend, they're running ice for it. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Okay, and then there was only one. It's gonna die as well. I think we'll have a little bit of team damage here. We had a lot of dudes just stepping in front of us, but it should be fine. At least this time we could we got to hold a corner. We got to use a couple of our rounds and we got an artillery strike in, so this should be a little bit better. Yep, that was better. Alright. One killing blow, one solo kill, three KMDDs, a thousand damage done, two hundred and forty taken, twelve team damage only, so kinda happy with myself and how I not murdered my teammates. This could have been a hundred more damage, I think, if I hadn't missed those early shots as much. But yeah, as I said, I'm a trash gamer guys. Six components and the UV kill. I don't even remember shooting the UV. Ah, yeah, yeah, on the on the left side. <laughs> Alright. Nice. Almost 600 match score. GG. So, um, name of the game is Get Close and Shoot People. Also, um, yeah. <laughs> yeah.
You know my feelings about this particular spawn point? Uh, enemy shots in 3, 2, 1. Maybe they don't have ELH lasers. Okay. Apparently they don't have lasers. Fine by me. It's more than fine by me. That's a very sad Timberwolf, by the way. He's a little bit angry. He looks like me when my auto cannons jam. Mm. <laughs> Bird spoiled beard. Oh god, no. Artillery strike online. I'm having so much fun, by the way, uh, playing Witcher Three right now. It's in, it's insane. I never really played the Hearts of Stone and uh, the the uh, the wine expansion into Beauclair, so. Um, I was positively surprised how good they are, and how much fun they are. I laughed, laughed myself silly yesterday as I found the Goblet of Fire in The Witcher. <laughs> okay, so, there's a couple of dudes here that want to get shot. Um, okay, we should do... <laughs> I think the enemy team just shot the teammates you would be. Crouch just going in like crazy, holy shit. This guy to go back a little bit. Good thing he didn't jump jet there. That could have hurt. Nope, can't shoot. Can't shoot. Can't move. I hate these um, rock formations that just block your movement completely. Let's keep going. All right. Target destroyed. We are moving, moving on. Target spotted. Target spotted. Keep rolling, 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 rolling on. Yep. Artillery strike. He's moving. Target spotted. <laughs> Look at the little guy. No fear against AC twenties. Okay, that's painful. Okay. Maybe we'll uh, go around the corner here. Oh, hello. Delta five low Atlas and catapult. Rip. I saw the side torso was open, so that was an easy shot. Now we go this way. Holy shit, that's a lot of dudes. Target acquired. Heat level critical. Target spotted. Ow. New target acquired. Why are they all pushing me? Heat level critical. Alright. Oh, holy shit. Acquired. This guy again. That didn't kill him. That didn't kill him. Woo! Am I alive? I think I'm alive. I'm just hoping not to kill myself if we're burning down, but hey! We're alive! One should CT, but we're alive. Uh oh, street crow. Okay, a couple of dudes are here. Ah! The number of dudes is limiting itself. Uh, hello? Oh, UV is dead. That makes me sad. New target Where's the piranha acquired. going? No, don't die to them. That's to me. Oh, he's dead. Target destroyed. Okay, well. New target acquired. That only leaves the stone crow. Holy shit. <laughs> Getting pushed by those back. two assaults. That was that was creepy. Luckily, I had like one dude back me, backing me up. Target Otherwise, spotted. this would have been over very quickly. Halfway there. I got cored. Nice and crispy. I also got my side torso shot out, by target the way, so... Destroyed. This is the point where you just have to take the overheat, guys, and you just have to go for the Hail Mary play because otherwise you're just dead. And I tried to, like, dance around that at Atlas, I would have died. Because he was clearly going for a suicide mission. Two killing blows, two solo kills. Oof, a solo kill, two assaults. Alright, that's alright. 3 KMDD, 600 damage done, 450 taken, and uh, 3 components. That's a solid run for this little bit of fighting. Very solid run. GG's.